It's Mark Weens here today. I am in Oyster Bay, Dar es Salaam, sitting down for a lunchtime feast at Little Grace Kiosk Restaurant, which is just behind the Kenyan Embassy. And I have a plate of food that looks like pure magnificentness on a plate right here, and I'm ecstatic to dig in. Okay, so this is sort of a home, a home country kind of restaurant. They cook in the house in the back and then they actually deliver, they bring the food from the house to this little restaurant which is facing the street in a yellow wheelbarrow, which that's a first for me, served from a wheelbarrow. And then they, you go in the back and you just sort of choose the different dishes that you want. Um, and they have a dining room and an outside and actually another another interesting thing is that the dining room doubles as a, I, I believe it is a wedding dress rental as well so those two go hand in hand wedding rental delicious food let me remove these extra bowls from my plate real fast and so what I got I ordered the uh, pilau which it looks like there's some big chunks of beef and fat within it um, and then I ordered the fried fish some kind of a spinach and then cabbage and then a pile of kachumbari on the top which is tomatoes and onions and peppers I can smell cinnamon in that and also on the side you got beans and this looks like a, oh, like a chili tomato gravy curry sauce. This is home cooked mama food, Tanzanian food and yeah, let's try to dig in. Let me first break into the pilau, oh, my mount, mountain of food, break into the pilau. I'm going to add some of the, this curry sauce to the rice first. Mm. Oh, that's wonderful. Mm. That is just pure home cooked, fresh. It's so fresh and I can taste the beef in that rice. Mm. I can taste the spices in that rice. A little bit of cinnamon, maybe some I don't know, I don't know what else. It tastes like cinnamon and beef mixed into this rice. The sauce is sort of a salty tomato based, almost like a tomato sauce with some chilies and carrots and eggplant and stuff in there. And then with those fresh tomatoes and onions, that makes it even better and fried to perfection. Oh yeah. A big piece of the fish. I'll put that on my rice with some of the kachumbari. And just fantastic. The fish is crispy on the outside. And along with that rice. Mm. You can actually taste that this food has like love in it. It's so good. I gotta say that was one of the best Tanzanian food meals that I've I've had so far in Dar es Salaam. That food was just straight up home style cooked, fresh, spiced to perfection and just a delicious combination of dishes. Check out my stomach after that meal. Thank <laughs> you.